بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب زدني علما Okay so let me quickly show you the options on how to do these things like how to reserve now you'll find the options here you can select always on option let me show you the always on option so we'll go with the dns center so dns center uh, it's in the networking category you can also search the specific options like just click on this when you click on this always on first we'll go with always on option I can see immediately it's going to load the topology, so you have to do nothing. You you you'll find the overview details here. What exactly this sandbox provide you, and how to access the sandbox. You can see the predefined topology here. You have some some devices available for access. Now, in order to access the DNS center, you can uh, simply use this link on the left side. When you click on this link, it's going to take you to the next, uh, probably the next. tab and then these are the credentials you need to log in so probably the same credentials i think for all uh, all the sandboxes for all this on probably they may vary just check this uh, option on the left side so this will provide you the options so now here you need to log in to that details devnet user and cisco 123 that's a login option So once you are able to successfully log in, then you will be, of course, the long credentials. Let me see. Devnet user. Yes. So make sure that you enter the correct credentials. Devnet user and then capital C, one two three, and then that exclamatory mark. Now I'm able to log in successfully here. now this is this actually loading the dns center access so it's going to load you the home page from where you can manage your dna dns center okay so now you can see it is uh, loading the home page probably and this is the dns center home page options so you'll find this is the home page from where you can see all the options relevant to the dns center now let me quickly show you the A reserve option. Reserve option is uh, simple. Where if you want to reserve a specific uh, sandbox at a specific time, like let's say I want to use the DNS center, maybe uh, the lab two, and I want to reserve. So when you click on that, it is going to uh, search for possible options or the possible slots available, and you just need to click on reserve. That's it. So if you don't have any alternate conflicting uh, reservations, then probably you will be able to reserve. on that specific uh, time and it will be available for 8 hours so you need to plan the things uh, prior in order to make sure that you are available to do the labs continuously for the 8 hours or utilize the specific uh, remote access to those specific products